What's up, everyone? Welcome to another episode of Think About It. I'm your host, Dan the Human. With me, as always, the effervescent Evie the Deer. So, Evie, what would you like to be when you grow up? A deer? Fair enough, fair enough. Today on Think About It, we're talking about the lie that society has made us to believe that we have to be somebody or do something when we grow up. Think about it. Think about it. So, yeah. What do you want to be when you grow up? That's the first one of the first questions we remember someone asking us as a kid. And I'm going to just say it right up front. Um, so, yeah, you don't need to do anything. You don't need to be anybody. Um, but people don't tell you that. We're told our entire life, what do you want to be when you grow up? What do you want to do? You should be a fill in the blank. But why do we have to be or do anything? People ask me, what do I do? I say, nothing. I don't do anything. And I love doing it. They ask me what I am or what I want to be. Me. I want to be me. I want to do me. <laughs> Why do I need to be someone else or do something else? Or, or they just come up to me and start telling me what they do or who they are. Like, um, oh, I do this and that and I love my job. I love doing blah, blah, blah. And that's all well and great. It's good that you love your job, but that's all it is. It's loving your job, but that's all it is. It's a job. Your job is not you. And you very well may love your job. I know this because everyone works for that one day they're able to retire and sit on the beach in Florida or the Caribbean somewhere, um, sipping pina coladas, not having to do anything. And you very well may love your job, but your job is not your life. Your job is just your job. Your life is what you're striving to do after your job uh, on the weekends. And, and people say, I love my job. I wouldn't choose to do anything else. But that's a lie. You're lying. I know this because everyone works for that one day that they're able to retire and sit on the beach somewhere in Florida or the Caribbean, uh, sipping pina coladas and not having to do anything at all. Or they're working th all week just to get the weekends off to be able to have some alone time or some you time. I also know this because if I gave you a golden ticket, a ticket that says you never had to work again, let's say it's a billion dollars, but that meant you wouldn't ever receive a paycheck from your job again. You could continue working, but it, but it would be without pay. Would you take the billion dollars and continue going to your job every day? Unpaid? I don't think so. We tell ourselves that we love our job, that we wouldn't do anything else, that we need our job to feel fulfillment in life, to feel accomplished, to keep us going in life. But that's a construct for your mind so that you can continue going to work every day. That's something that society has created so you continue to fulfill your role as just another cog, another peg in the ever rotating gear. But given the alternative, not working, like every single one of you would take it in a second. So yeah, I don't do anything. I just do me. I don't get paid for it, but I love doing it and I wouldn't have it any other way. So yeah, you don't need to be anything. You don't need to do anything. They lied to you. Again, as always, do not believe anything you're told. Think for yourself, question everything, and help us stop sentient enslavement by hitting the like and the subscription buttons below. Give us a thumbs up if you like what we're doing and you wanna see more. Think about it.